go. Wines. Not a bad launching oh. pad. Can have a deep entry if he chooses. Kept it pretty low to Dixon and was there a free? Miller a cut across, but the interference was sufficient. And it is a free kick to Charlie Dixon. It was good from close range, normally Charlie Dixon. And he goes back and settles a few early nerves. Port Adelaide has a goal. Vicentini took front position. Schomburg has got bowled over by Rosie. His running mate Butters working in tandem, high downfield. Quickly summed all up and kicked it long, Rosie. Michael Annie from the side. Evans stayed at the back. The footy found him and he finds the goals. It's a quality finish. That is a, a real quality finish. Tall at times. Burton can play taller, but neither really key position. Toad into the clear. Dersma. Smith trying to take care of him. He might have been a little too vigorous. Hostile crowd has to put all that aside. Skip in, do what he's paid to do. And couldn't have done it any more convincingly than that. Six minutes to go. Keys read the cues well. The slide from Dan Curvis. Drew. Not an easy ball to mark. No one does. Evans kept his feet, kept the line on the footy, and knew what to do next. That's two for Frank. I think it was Horn Francis with the was it that Horn yeah. Francis with the tap over yeah. the top? It's clever, wasn't it? Was, it was. It was very clever. Just that understanding of what was the Adelaide player right up his back. Yeah, oh, nice. Yeah. Very good. Nice finish too. Could have run straight, but decided just to angle things up a little bit. Rosie to the middle. Lining up to be part of it, Drew. After the bounce, it's steep, it's Finlayson. Hinge went to ground and felt helpless. It starts now with Jeremy Finlayson. He's kicked crucial goals during the season at important times, and he provides one here at the start of the third. Well, they have to dig a little deeper now, Port. Butters safely enough to haunt Francis. Just waits the appropriate couple of beats and gives it back to Butters. They come relentlessly, Port to full forward. Dixon could see where Rosie was. Quick snap across to Boak. The sub has kicked one, and he's punching the cool line air. In this third term, it's been 2 3 to 1 2. So Port winning the quarter, cutting the margin. Evans for a third. Frankie goes to Hollywood. He's been the difference up forward for them, Jono. This wow. man. That's an excellent goal, too. He gets no separation whatsoever no. from Jones. It's just the fact he's got pure strength and he's clean. The nature of the game for Port Adelaide. Cross to Houston. They need one soon. Dixon to the outside. Rosie ready to pounce. Just not quite coming together, though. Power Pepper threw his weight around. Finlayson, Marshall, trying to work out a way to goal and Wines might have found it. He has. And he had to turn tackler. He, he slowed Charlie down, didn't stop his progress completely. And here's an opportunity for Butters. Cool hand. And Evans again, he could kick his fourth here. He's their only multiple goal kicker, and he's kicked four. And I think that's great for his own development and confidence in the competition at AFL level.